Welcome to CBS Sports coverage of the NCAA Tournament. Today's game is between the Weber State Wildcats and the Arizona Wildcats. And of course, the ever so popular tournament bracket, especially at this time of year. And our starting lineup. Best the kids at the point guard position should give us quite a show tonight. I'm looking forward to that matchup as well. And here's what the plan of attack is for either team in regards to tempo. And after all that anticipation, we're underway. Junior. You always want your players going hard to the basket like that. Wouldn't you agree, Coach? Wow, Gus, when you drive it with authority, only good things happen. Drives like that usually end up with a basket and or a foul. Nice look. Bam. On the look. look at that block. Terrific reaction. Gordon handles the pass. The Wildcats running their zone offense. Very effective because of the power on the glass. It opens up that opportunity for tips. Ashley handles the feed. Foul on the play. Too aggressive on defense. Draft. Pushes it. The Wildcats now running the four round one. Must be alert on that defensive end because guys get pinned and they can step out and knock down the deep one. They work the perimeter. for the foul. Too aggressive on defense here. He winds up with the foul. You always get your hand reaching in. You get in trouble. Seniors are important, Gus, because they bring so much to the table in terms of experience, accountability, and consistency. As a coach, you like to have guys like that on the roster who you can depend on. Makes the foul shot. Make the freebies, Billy. Down on the rim and shoot the ball with confidence. Tough it inside. Shots up. The sophomore. Time out on the floor, ladies and gentlemen. More CBS Sports coverage after this. And we're back, ready to get things going again after the timeout. Fires! The Wildcats are having a tough time hitting from the floor. They can't find one, Gus. 
The Wildcats now looking to run their stuff against this zone. And what they do is put it on the deck, creating a pinch, and then find the open guy. He can't get it to go. Big time presentation at the rim. He made himself bigger by extending his arms. The Wildcats set up for a round one. That's tough because guys can make shots and yet they can penetrate and care. Jump shot. The Wildcats can't get anything to fall. I'll tell you, Gus, when a team is shooting the ball this poorly, they must get the ball back on defense, create some turnovers, and get some runouts. That's a good pass. You know he sets up his teammates for open looks. Guys have to be ready every trip down the floor. On the left side. Under one minute remaining on the game clock. Fires. And yet another missed field goal attempt, Coach. They're struggling. I don't think any of them are concentrating right now. Down the lane. Finger roll. So easy. They work the perimeter. He makes the block. Out on the left wing. Jump shot. No. Will he get back up with it? Off the mark. The Wildcats are really controlling the tempo. Doing a nice job of controlling the speed of the game, Gus. They're really dialed in here, and Coach has got to enjoy it. He looks for three. Comes up empty from deep. And the ball is out of bounds. We'll go back the other way. Gordon has been a force on the court today. With the big shot. And he can't get the bounce. Inbound from the baseline. He shoots from the corner. He missed it. Give it here. Gordon receives the ball. The Wildcats working, changing it up against the zone. And that's what makes them tough to defend. They understand how to take advantage of openings. The Wildcats set up for... He blocks the shot. Out of bounds, and we're staying right here. They set it up from the baseline. And that one is blocked. The Wildcats now looking to run their stuff against this zone. And what they do is put it on the deck, creating a pinch, and then find the open guy. The top of the key. Under one minute remaining on the game clock. Now that's taking it strong to the rim, isn't it? That's a great take strong to the 10. That puts incredible pressure on the D when you go to the hoop like that. Now they work it around the perimeter. In the lane. Can't get it to go. Pitts with the ball. Can't get it to go. Oh, physical play. Top of the key. Inside. The Wildcats set up into their zone motion offense. And this is difficult because they understand how to take advantage of mismatches. Looking for a good shot. Change of possession. Let's get another look at the layup. You've got to make these inside ones, Gus. They're high percentage shots. They've just got to be completed. The Wildcats on offense. They have four guys on the perimeter and one down low. Great passing lanes to the big fella. All right, Raph, this one's over. One team moves on. One team's going home.
Well, the better team won because they protected the basketball. They made sure they converted on the free throw line. They did all of the little intangibles we consistently talk about. And that was the difference in this game. Coach, let's take a moment to look at our players of the game here today. These two kids were fantastic. They played hard and put forth an effort that I'm certain your coaches will be happy with. That does it for us here today. Until next time, for Coach Raftery, I'm Gus Johnson. Thanks for watching College Basketball here on CBS Sports.